This is the largest investment in neighborhood safety in our city's history. Columbus Mayor Andrew Ginther proposing more than $660 million to the Department of Public Safety. A lot of the money will go toward expanding programs that have been piloted throughout the city this year. The plan would also boost the city's police roster, and it comes as the city sits on the edge of breaking its yearly homicide record. Part of the mayor's 2022 budget proposal also includes more than $5 million for what's called the Alternative Response Project. Good evening, I'm Colleen Marshall. Carrie is off tonight. Mayor Ginther says it's been a big success. The project involves a different approach to certain 911 calls. NBC4's Eric Halperin is live downtown tonight, taking a closer look at how this project will work. Colleen, when you call 911, a dispatcher picks up the phone. That still happens with this program, but in addition to the dispatcher, there's also a paramedic and mental health specialist on the other Okay, does your son have any problem with um, police at all? Alberta Muhammad is a social worker with Columbus Public Health. Now she also has a new role, bringing her inside the city's 911 emergency communication center. Every call is unique, every call is different. Um, and we don't, there's no like one size fits all kind of thing when it comes to that. She's a community crisis clinician for what's called the right response unit, handling certain 911 calls with a dispatcher and a paramedic. It's a lot of work. It is. So you're navigating a person's mental health issues, you're navigating police issues, you're navigating fire, and you're trying to get this person to what makes sense for them. The unit is part of the city's alternative response program. The pilot program started in June. On certain 911 calls determined not to be immediate emergencies, it looks at responding in ways that might not always involve the police or fire departments. We've always done a good job, but I think this has allowed us to get to the next step, the next level, to be more effective in how we're helping the community. According to the Department of Public Safety, the pilot program was in operation for 72 hours from early June to early July and reduced the number of calls needing police by 62%. Mayor Andrew Ginther says 48% of calls taken were able to be redirected to other agencies or services. He's proposing more than $5 million for the project in his 2022 budget. It's going to help change that trajectory of the violence and the despair, the, the, you know, the hopelessness that's out there that where folks end up resorting to that by providing some more of that prevention. And project leaders say they'll use 2022 to collect more data and figure out exactly how many people they'll need on their team. Local for you in Columbus, I'm Eric Alpern, NBC4. Thank you, Eric.